those of us out there that don't have the most organized of desks, this tutorial is for you. As kitchen designers, we already have so many sources of information that we have to go to on a daily basis to look up information. As brilliant as the search feature in the 3D Warehouse is that you saw in the last video using the 3D Warehouse, there is a way to make life even easier. With your free Google account, you can access the 3D Warehouse and you can store frequently used models and collections right into your account for quick and easy access later. If you don't have a Google account, head on over to google.com to create one. It's free. In SketchUp, make sure that you're signed into Google. Click on the G icon in the lower left hand corner of the screen. It will pop up this window. If you are signed in, you will see your account information. If you aren't, there'll be a space to log in. If you aren't logged in, you won't be able to organize your models for use later. Next, click the Get Models button on the Google bar. This will bring you to the main page of the 3D Warehouse. Now, before we start searching for models, we need to create a collection that we are going to store our found models into. If you look on the top right corner, you will see a link for My Models and My Collections. The My Models link is a place that you can upload your models that you've created in SketchUp so you can share them online. We will be covering that in the next video. Right now, we want to create a collection, or a portfolio, if you will, of some appliances. So I'm going to click on the My Collections link. As you can see, we have no collections. Let's select the Create link to get started making a collection. Give your collection a name and a description. If you have a website, you can include that in here as well. Now this next option is really important. There are two types of collections that you can create. One type is a collection of models. This would be a collection that you would use to sort individual models in, such as a few of your favorite appliances or decorations that you use on a regular basis. The other option is to create a collection of collections. For example, you could store a whole line of cabinets or a whole line of appliances without having to add each and every model to that collection. This is the best approach when adding a line from a manufacturer, as when they add something to their collection, it will automatically be there, and you won't have to go and add all of the new items. For our first collection, we will be creating a collection of models, so we're just going to put one model in. You can share your collections with anyone you want. By default, they are set as public. This means that anyone searching the 3D Warehouse can find your collection, however they cannot edit your collection. They can only view and download the models. You can also add an icon or logo to your collection. This is a great way to promote yourself or your company. Click Save Changes. Now you have your first collection. Let's add a model to it. Go up here to the search bar and let's find that KitchenAid refrigerator that I used in the last 3D Warehouse tutorial. Just type in KitchenAid and push search. I'll select the refrigerator that I used. Right here you will see the link, add this model to a collection. Click it and a drop down menu appears with the collection that we just created. Select add and that model will be added to the collection. Go back up here to my collections link to see it. Now the next time you do a kitchen and you want to use this refrigerator, Simply click on the 3D Warehouse button on the Google bar within SketchUp, select My Collections, and select the collection we just created, and download that model right into your drawing. No more searching for the best models. Now, I will show you how to store a whole line of cabinets into your Google account for easy access. Since we are going to store a whole collection into our Google account, we are going to need to make a new collection of collections. Get back into the 3D Warehouse by clicking the 3D Warehouse button on the Google bar. Now click on the My Collections tab. Fill out the title and description and other options as we did earlier. For the Collection Will Contain option, make sure that you select Other Collections. 
as this collection is going to contain other product lines, not individual models. Click Save Changes, and there you will see our newly created collection. In the search bar, type in Kitchen and Bath. Before you hit Search, though, change the Search For settings to Collections. This will search for only collections, not models. Press Search, and one of the first listed collections is that featured Kitchen and Bath collection. Let's go ahead and select it. You could add the whole kitchen and bath collection to your collection, but I want to add a specific line of cabinets. Let's add general casework. As you can see here in the general casework collection, it actually contains three other collections, base cabinets, wall cabinets, and tall cabinets. If I click add this collection to another collection, I will actually have saved in my collection of collections the base, tall, and wall cabinets automatically. Let's go ahead and do that. Go back to the My Collections link in the upper right hand corner. You will see the collection we just created. Inside it are all of the general casework cabinets, bases, walls, and talls. You can now access these quickly and easily right within SketchUp without searching for them each and every time. Keeping your frequently used models organized and easily accessible like this can really increase your productivity. In the next video, we'll show you how you can share and collaborate your models online using the 3D Warehouse.